Hello guys and welcome to the highlights from our pre-season game against League One side Portsmouth, a game which will be watched by a crowd of 2,250 people. Gosport was definitely the team that made the better start in this game, with it taking just a little over 7 minutes for Gosport to find the back of the net. Williams managed to pick out Ramos and the striker then got the ball through the keeper's legs to roll past the goal line, but the linesman's flag then went up, which would mean the goal would be chalked off for offside. Immediately straight after this Pompey had the next big opportunity, a pass from Williams was intercepted by the Pompey defender Dockerill with the defender setting up Kobe Moto who ended up blazing the ball over the bar nearly destroying one of the windows on the newly decorated bus placed just behind the goal. With both sides having good opportunities, it would ultimately be Burrow who would take the lead. A ball in from Kavanaugh managed to fall perfectly to Brad Tarbuck, with the midfielder smashing a shot at Norris and forcing a save. But quick instincts from Rafa Ramos meant he had just enough time to smash a ball past the goalkeeper and make it 1-0 to Gosport. Straight after the goal, Pompey used their brute force to create numerous chances. The first coming from new signing Scully. Welsh international Joe Morrell managed to set up Scully on the edge of the box. The winger managed to wriggle past the number of defenders and was through on goal, but the man of the moment Callum Smart managed to deflect the effort with his foot being just enough to stop the goal. Five minutes later, our keeper managed to pull out not just one, but two wonder saves. One from a tight angle, Scully managed to slash a shot across goal, requiring Smart to make a fingertip save to deny the first opportunity. But seconds later, the ball fell to Motto, but like Superman, Smart flew to the rescue, diving again and putting his body in front of the ball. But unfortunately, even Smart couldn't save Morel's effort from 20 yards out, which rocketed into the top corner to make it all square. Yet again though, Gosport made the better start in the second half. Gosport's trialist number 11 managed to create an opportunity for Brad Tarbuck. The midfielder did just enough to escape his defender, but the post denied him his goal. Unbelievably, the post was struck again seconds later, thanks to a great first touch from the former Petersfield man Alex Barca enabled him to get his shot across. The Pompey goalkeeper was easily beaten, but again the post denied Gosport the lead. Gosport even had one final opportunity to get a late goal. Number 11 was behind the attack yet again with him placing the perfect ball to trialist number 18. But the Pompey goalkeeper came off his line making himself look massive to the trialist and saving the shot. Unfortunately there was just enough time for Pompey to steal the win. A corner from Harvey Laidlord was just a bit too high for the Gosport trialist keeper leading him to drop in the ball and it fall into Phil Maloney, Duet White who managed to get the final touch to divert the ball past the keeper and to give Pompey the win with this not being the welcome back Gosport fans wanted. There was even just enough time for one last goal. A Pompey trialist played Destiny Ojo clear of the gospel defence, resulting with the academy player lashing the ball past the borough keeper to secure the win for Pompey. Overall though, there was a lot of good signs from gospel in this pre-season fixture. We wish Pompey all the best for the upcoming season, and we hope you come back for our next highlights package against Fleetlands. 